Jeremy Long, aka Drummer Rev. But what does that name mean anyway? A few years ago, I was serving on staff at a church in Charlotte, North Carolina, serving part-time as a staff member, volunteering part-time with the worship team as a drummer. On the day of my ordainment, the staff at that church thought it was only fitting if they dubbed me Drummer Rev. So I guess over the years, it's just kind of stuck. But I like it. It says two really important things about me as a person. First, the obvious. I am a drummer. I'm a drummer through and through. It's my heartbeat, my passion, my soul. I view the world through the lenses of an artist, a musician, a percussionist. It influences how I think. It influences who I am. It influences even my spirituality. Which leads me to the second part of that title, Rev. Yes, I'm an ordained minister. From a very early age, I felt a calling, if you will, an inner impulse that part of my identity was to be a shepherd, a teacher, a spiritual guide, to help teach people deeper spiritual truths from scripture, to help them connect with God in more meaningful ways. It's part of who I am. I'm a drummer, but I'm also a rev. But let's face it, that title, Reverend, it's just a little bit artificial, isn't it? In all reality, in the scriptures, there's no distinction between reverend and non-reverend, minister, laity. We're all ministers. You, me, we're ministers. God has given you some kind of a special talents, a gift, an ability that he desires for you to give back to him with excellence, to glorify his name and to let the world know through that, that Jesus is real. So my goal, my hope is that this video blog, DrummerRev.com, will be an inspiration to you, an inspiration to embrace the person God has made you and the gifts that he's given you, that you and me together can give that back to Christ and let the world see through that, that Jesus really is real. So if you've got any questions, I'd love to hear them. Shoot them my way to DrummerRev at gmail.com. Until then, groove on.